Hello, I'm Weaver Godfrey, and I'm going to show you how to make my Christmas turkey stuffing recipe using only my mouth. I'm sure you know that no good stuffing recipe is complete without the onion, so we're going to start there. You want to finely dice it? Mm. Really, really small pieces is key. So it cooks quite nicely when it goes in. So there we go, there we've finally diced half an onion. What a lovely way to start. We're now going to dice some carrot. So you're looking to uh, go at about half a centimetre along, put it in your mouth, chop it up a bit further and get it out so we're getting nice even pieces. Moving now onto our celery, the green dream. It takes more calories to eat celery than it does that it gives you. Interesting, I always use the right hand side of my mouth, but you do what feels more natural to you. It's rather like having a drink, the celery bit. Now time for some aromatic herbs, and I'm going to use fresh parsley. I find flat leaf far sexier than curly, so that's what I'm going to use. So we want to de-stem right, the parsley. Well and then I'm just going to finely dice a handful. Nice. Crazy. As if by magic, really diced crazy. parsley. Like, Perfect. Who is she Next. serving this up to? My favourite friend, the garlic. There is nothing better than the smell of garlic for days and weeks. Be aware that the garlic is very, very hard to handle and it really burns your mouth, but it's incredibly good for you. So stay with it and your stuffing will taste the better for it. Well, there we go. It's really hurting my tongue, but, you know. Now it's time for our bread, the meatier part of the stuffing. I normally say, if you don't know how to target your bread, go at it like a hamburger. Mm. It's a very good loaf. I always choose the same loaf. Perfectly spherical. No bread knives, no blades. A very, very safe stuffing. It's not traditional to use a lemon, but I don't like to do things traditionally, so I'm going to add some lemon zest and lemon juice. And for safety's sake, I am not going to use a zester. Quite an unusual flavour. Look at these lovely zesty lines. You don't get that with a normal zester at all. And then we're just going to stick our thumb in, wind it in, start to get some of those lovely juices out. And now we're going to bind our stuffing with an egg or two. And I'm going to do the whisking in my mouth. any good recipe, we use a lot of butter in our stuffing mix, and I don't have a microwave, so I'm just going to warm the butter with the cosy insides of my mouth. A little salt, some black peppercorn. There we go. Seasoned and That's ready to can't. stuff our turkey. Eat all I've got myself a beautiful turkey. Open up cool. and then retrieve our beautiful stuffing. I can almost hear the Christmas carols now. Let's push him in. Beautiful stuffing mix. Absolutely perfect and made in 100% safety. And now for a final little drizzle of oil, and then our bird is ready to cook. So we're just going to massage that in 